Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. Greetings, Ali Shama here. Welcome to my little man cave and more Android rugged phone reviews. Today in this video, I have the all new Doji S98 with dual screen check this out isn't this cool yes now this screen is bigger and you have more themes to configure on that so let me bring the camera closer and give you a closer look at the doji s98 briefly talk about its features and of course at the end of this video you will also get my two cents my feelings about this phone what do i think about doji s98 for sure the phone has some very good features that will attract you and many more especially those who like gaming and rugged phone not to mention those who work in harsh environments they definitely gonna like the rugged phone with 5g and all the other powerful features that the phone has to offer <laughs> Alright, this is the Doji S98 rugged phone in my hands. I got this black version, which I kind of like, but do, they do have a red version, I believe, as well, with uh, with these uh, side walls or side panels in red that look really nice. The first thing that you will notice is that the rear screen has got bigger, you know, and it has nice premium looks with these. Uh, you know themes that you can select and change not just that it's a touch screen and you can listen to music and uh, you know um, answer the calls okay so right now because I don't have a sim so I can only have time or music and of course when you see the time it has a date and battery levels as well that you can check right on the rear screen and you can also configure it so that when you flip the phone it will actually automatically turn on just like that now let's talk about the cameras on doji s98 because these are the most important things in our life without the phones and their cameras we cannot even live nowadays so first thing that you want to know is the selfie camera right here which is a 16 megapixel you can take selfies and you know also record videos with the 16 megapixel cameras right here and then on the rear once again we have triple ai cameras 64 megapixel okay so those uh these three cameras powered by ai as they claim take very very good photos and honestly speaking i have been taking some photos and videos outdoors they actually turn out very very good not just that it also has a 20 megapixel night vision camera right here this is the 20 megapixel night vision camera then we have an 8 megapixel wide angle lens and then we have a 64 megapixels main camera and we have two infrared uh, night light or night vision lights and we also have the flash ordinary flash are for the camera and of course the dual screen right here now on the back i like the build is kind of nice and rugged of course it's a rugged phone and these uh, uh i don't know they claim that these are aircraft grade aircraft grade aluminum alloy they really look nice and give it a very nice premium look now if you come to the right of the phone you will see that they have now on s98 given you a separate fingerprint sensor right here okay before on do gv20 the the button on off button also was the fingerprint sensor but they decided to go away with that and given you a separate fingerprint sensor then you have an on off button and of course volume buttons right here on the left side is again the same thing you have a custom key a, a key that you can customize and check this out when you pull this out you have a tf card slot so you can increase the memory of your phone and then you have two 5g slots 5g sim slots you can use two different numbers two different sim cards in this phone and you know enjoy having two numbers on one phone now when it comes to the display it's a 6.3 inch fhd plus water droplet display and 
to be honest, it's really nice and fluid. It's running Android 12 system, so you actually have all the new options from the Android 12 system that you can enjoy on this phone. The phone offers 15 watt wireless charging as well, and it's a 33 watt fast charging. And it has a built in 6,000 milliamp battery that can give you a lot of use time on this phone. Phone is IP68 and IP69 uh, waterproof as well. So, um, of course, rugged phone, you know, drop it, carefully drop it because you have a, a rear screen here as well. The phone has a built-in 8G plus 256 GB of, you know, RAM and ROM. So you have a lot, a lot of space. And again, you can insert a separate TF card to increase the storage in this phone. The phone is preloaded with all the Google uh, features and Google apps. It's, of course, a Google phone, so it also has a Google Pay. It also has an NFC, and when it comes to the GPS in it, which is GLONASS, Beidou, uh, Galileo A GPS, GPS system for, you know, precise tracking, <laughs> precise tracking of who you are, where you are, and what you are doing. Now, when it comes to gaming, you will actually enjoy 2 gigahertz octa-core MediaTek Helio G96 processor and a nice gaming power of this phone. You have one game that I can actually start right away so you can actually see what it feels like to play game on this phone. I can't see because the camera is blocking my view but I will try to do something. Ooh. Nice, very nice and smooth graphics, man. I can tell you that. Oh, I'm going to die, sorry. The phone is blocking my view, so... Oh, no, sorry, the, the camera, not the phone. So, did we get... Hey, take this, this is... Okay, you have to click on it. So, uh, yeah, as I said, it's running very nice and smooth graphics. And if you have games with, you know, more heavier requirements. I suck at gaming, man. So, if you have games which actually, you know, require more heavier processor power, you do have a game boost in this one as well. Of course, Doogee S98 rare display, you cannot live without that. So you have a little bit of options to configure the rare display. Let me just see, hold on, go to the settings and go to the rare display and rare display themes. So you have uh, themes for the clock like these, which you can basically configure. And to be honest, I was kind of disappointed. They could have given you many more different kind of themes. I hope they can give you more updates and more themes time by time with the updates. But right now, to be honest, kind of disappointed. You have only few themes that you can change. So for example, I want to go for this one. I will say apply. Okay. And you go back and your display has changed on the back. I actually personally like this. My kids also like this one because this looks like nice with gears and everything. What a premium watch on the back right here. Okay, so then you have in call. Okay, you can change these two themes only. And then for the music, you have these two themes. I like the one with the engine piston kind of things right here. All right, I believe I have described most of the key features of Doogee S98. Now, for those who prefer a good camera on the phone and want to know how good this camera is, go ahead, check out these pictures and video clips that I shot outdoors and some I shot indoors in this room with pitch black dark room to show you the night vision capabilities of this Doogee S98's night vision camera.
this is my room at night okay and I'm just gonna turn off the light and this is a standard video this is not a uh, night vision video all right well there are some lights from the window that's all you can see and you can see after turning off the light I can still see everything in my room everything is very clear look at that the parts for my thunder jaw uh, the robot from horizon zero dawn Ooh, my ginger beer is sitting there and uh, oh I'm hitting things a little 3d printed monster right here <laughs> well, this is me. <laughs> I scared you. I know. I <laughs> I know. I got you. I got you there. I know. <laughs> so night vision video, and this video is also being shot. The night vision video is really nice and clear. And here are some night vision photos. <laughs> I hope I didn't get you so hard there uh, so you have watched the results of the camera of this phone and I believe for an average user and even for an average tiktoker I mean this is going to be good camera I and mean, camera is good enough on this phone I'm pretty satisfied with the camera given that I also vlog sometimes with the phones and this phone has very good results on the camera now the most important point is a rugged phone how rugged it is can you drop it yes you can drop it like this when it comes to this on the table or on the ground but to be honest my feeling is because i mean look at this this screen is big right here you don't want to drop it in a way that something hits this screen because if anything hits this screen it will happily break i'm sure about that how tough this front conning gorilla glass is well i haven't tested it and to be honest i have never dropped a phone i've used many different phones and I, my personal favorite that i'm using is a oneplus 70. i've dropped it many times and to be honest i've never dropped a phone in a way that it will hit something uh, on the screen and you know break the screen so i haven't tested this but again if you look at from the sides on this phone there's a slight raised spot on each corner so dropping it straight this way it will take the hits on those you know rugged uh, raised spots and won't touch the screen but again those spots are so little raised that any kind of little stone or something you know slight or high can actually cause the screen to hit hard and break again it is a rugged phone in a sense that it's a waterproof um, all kind of temperatures and stuff like that and some of the daily drops it will take so if you work in a harsh environments if you like for example you are a woodworker you're working in a workshop you're a metal worker you work in dust you work outdoors you're an adventurer you are a camper you go for swimming you go for you know a surfboarding and water sports of course this phone will do the job you can even dive for a few meters and take underwater videos and pictures with this phone so thank you very much for watching this video i hope you liked it give this video a big thumb up and of course stay subscribed to my channel hit that little bell icon turn on all the notifications so that you stay updated for all the upcoming uploads once again if you like rugged phones you might want to look at Doogee S98. There's a link in video description. Have fun, people. I'm out. Come on. You know what to do. Hit that like button. It's right there. I know you can do it. Oh, while you're at it, also hit the subscribe button. Right there. Come on. Don't be shy. Just hit it. Thank you very much for all your support towards my work. That I post regular and fresh content on my channel. 
just for you. Hit that like button.